What's up? Ian here and this is my first impression and unboxing of the Quest Style M15 Portable Dongle Deck Headphone Amplifier. I bought this with my own money so uh, if you guys are interested do check out um, Hi-Fi Go's website down in the description below and tell them I sent you. Okay so I'm just gonna open this up and then listen to it for the very first time and then I'm gonna compare it with the Hip Deck two all right which i have right here and then see what's the difference all right so let's begin with the unboxing of this okay so this is retailing for 269 us dollars and it has uh the Questal patented cma modules it's got the flex shape uh, grade ES9281AC Sabre DAC chip okay it's got dual outputs which is 3.5 mm single ended and 4.4 balance output uh, it can handle uh, PCM DSD and MQA high res uh, signals uh, it's got ultimately clean output performance with low noise floor uh, and class leading ultra low distortion two levels of gain switch led indicators for the gain and active bit rate and low power consumption torx power chip and truly high res lossless experience uh, it's got a minimal minimalistic design with metal housing and transparent cover and it supports multiple devices like tablets smartphones uh, windows mac systems okay and let's just quickly go through the specs so basically right it's got the uh, the decoding parameters is uh, pcm 32 bit 384 kilohertz dsd 256 the output for 3.5 is not stated here but it's 11.997 uh, milliwatt at 300 ohms and the voltage output is at 1.8 uh, vrms and at the 4.4 balance uh, connection uh, the output is 22.6 milliwatts at 300 ohms and the uh, voltage output max is 2.6 to 4 vrms okay the frequency response is 20 to 20,000 hertz and the noise uh, distortion is 0.0003 percent and yeah okay so let's open this up i think there's a tab here let's cut this so exciting i've been looking for forward to this okay see oh nice wow look at that window that clear window that shows everything inside that deck amp okay and let's pull this out first and see what's else okay so it comes with deep by default all right uh, USB C to USB a dongle well cable and then it also comes with a USB-C to USB-C cable, okay? All right. And then, of course, it comes with some paperwork. I'm not going to go through that. And that's it. All right. So let's take a look at the DAC M itself. Very, very nice DAC M. Now look at that window there. And then... You can see all the internals. This is the LED. You can see the uh, connectors and the DAC chip right here. I'm not too sure you can see. Very, very nice. And on this side, you'll see the connections. You have uh, the 4.4 balance out and the 3.5 single ended out. On this end here, focus you will see the low and the high gain okay and of course this is the USB-C so the one that I got is the USB-C to the lightning cable so this one will enable me to connect to my iPhone okay and iPad no yeah iPhone right so you have the M15 mobile lossless DAC with headphone amplif amplifier and that's it so let's peel this off 
all the ASMR out there this is for you wow look at that okay so very nice I love this design and this very transparent look okay so now let's test this so I got my iPhone here all right this is my iPhone and I've got my hip deck 2 so hip deck 2 also has uh, USB uh, lightning cable here so I'm gonna connect it to the same device and then I have my earphone right this so happened to to be sitting around I'm, I'm not specifically showcasing this happened to be sitting around that uh, I can change the um, plugs okay so I can change from 3.5 to 4.4 and then I'll, I'll listen to see if there's any difference so I'll, I'll go with the 3.5 first okay and then I'll connect it to the actually you know what let's listen to this one first okay and then I'll connect the USB-C dongle to my phone all right so let's put the uh, earphones into my ear all right so let's open up my favorite song okay so that's my favorite song let's listen to it briefly i'm not going to put you guys through the whole entire song i'm just going to listen to it and then i'll let you guys know what's the difference that i hear okay so first up is the Questal m15 uh and li i'm listening to this uh at 3.5 wow very clean very clean sound and uh, very lean as well very nice very very crystal clear sound it cleans up the noise very well and the notes is very defined okay so i'm not going to listen to the entire thing All right so now i'm going to swap out to my hip deck 2 so i'm going to use the same headphone and cable the only thing that is different is the deck m okay and this one has a volume switch that one doesn't have this one has got bass boost which is x bass that one doesn't have which i'm not gonna there's a gain also so i'm not going to turn on the gain i'm going to turn off the gain so everyone's going to be on the level playing ground and let's listen to this song again okay so this one sounds warmer it's got more weight to the tone the sound stage is a little bit closer it's more intimate yes it's closed in so the Questal M15 has got a provides a wider sound stage really nice okay so let's pause the song now I can hear the difference now I'm gonna swap out to 4.4 and let's see if there's change in power obviously there will be okay so now this is 4.4 balance out and then I'm gonna plug it to the Questal and then plug it to my iPhone okay so now this power now let's listen to this song again and hear the difference okay so now the piano sounds a bit more full a bit more body it still maintains that clean sound that it provides but it's not as lean now that it's got more body sound stage is the same as the 3.5 but what i hear is that this one has got more presence All right so now swap out to the hip deck 2 and same thing i'm just gonna plug it to the 4.4 right here and let's hear the difference okay let's reset the song same thing this was this one has got a fuller sound as well the body the, the piano sounds a bit more full more substance including the lead singer it sounds a bit more firm the sound stage is the same it's got in fact it's more intense it's close closer it sounds clean as well but this one has got a warmer note weight a warmer tone on the hip deck too okay i think that's enough i can hear the difference all right so um very very nice very very nice um deck amplifier very small and compact and well i've not tried the um the gain yet okay i've not played around with the gain but i will play around with the gain and this is a very nice deck amplifier clean lean well i wouldn't say dry but it's got uh not a not warm all right it's not warm well it's kind of very, very neutral all right neutral type of uh, tone and uh yeah it's actually very clean sounding and 
the sound stage is it opens up the sound stage and uh, with the 4.4 connection it gives it more body more texture uh, to the audio that you're listening to and as compared to the hip deck 2 hip deck 2 uh, sounds a bit warmer the sound stage is a bit more intimate more closed in uh, and it gives me a, a more heavier note weight in terms of the sound more musical i would say this one sounds more musical this one sounds a bit more analytical okay more clean and very clinical sounding right okay so yeah so that's that's my very quick impression and unboxing of this Questile m15 uh, deck m um, dongle right so i hope you guys learned something from this video or enjoyed watching this video if you did please give this video a thumbs up thank you so much for watching i hope you guys have a great day ahead and i'll see you again in my next video cheers